let us see the melee type machine with the non overlapping so in melee machine number of states equal to number of bits given in the sequence so in the given sequence number of bits equal to 4 so that is why we have to take four states that means four circles we have to take in state diagram okay so this is uh, for the state s0 and this is for state s1 and this is for state s2 and this is for state s3 okay so as we know that initial state is always reset state so this is reset state all the circles are representing only states not outputs okay and second state is s1 s2 and s3 okay and each and every directed transition lines are representing both inputs and outputs as we know that our sequence is 1001 upon giving an input 1 the state s0 is moving to state s1 okay state s0 is moving to state s1 okay so input is given as 1 and what about output output is 0 because when input is given as 1, only one bit of the given sequence is detected, not all bits. So, that is why output is 0. Right? And similarly, when we give an input 0 at state S1, then the state S1 moves to state S2. input is 0 and still output is 0 because the sequence is not detected and giving 0 at the state S2 it moves to state S3 okay this is state S3 so the input given is 0 still output is 0 because the sequence detected up to this instant up to the state s3 is 100 only not 1001 okay so now after completing these four states like this we have to immediately draw the boxes just below the states except initial state see here this is one box i have drawn here and we have to draw another box here so now you see here when input is given as 1 at state 0 then it is moving to next state s1 still output is 0 so up to the state okay up to the state s1 how many bits are detected only one bit that is 1 okay similarly at the state s2 two bits are detected see 1 and 0 so two bits are detected 1 0 and at the state s3 3 bits are detected this 1 0 0 so 3 bits are detected 1 double 0 okay now we have to check other case also that is if we give input as 0 what happens so when input is given as 0 it will be remain in the same state because sequence is not 0 at first bit when we give input 0 transition line is connected to the same state it will not move to further state right so next one is given when input one is given to the state s0 then it is moved to s1 here in this case so zero input is given then this s1 is moved to s2 state okay then if we give one what happens okay if we give input one at this particular state s1 what happens already the state has one bit that is one when i give input as one see here we have to check this one bit state with the last bit okay this last bit when we compare this last bit with one bit state if they are matched then we have to connect the directed state transition line to the same state so in this case so here when we give input as one the last bit is matched with single state bit or one bit state okay so that is why we have to connect the directed 
state transition line to the same state when input is 1. Okay. And when we consider here S2, upon giving an input 0, it is moved to state S3. Suppose if we give input 1, okay, already at this particular state, there are uh, two bits detected that is 1, 0. When I give input as 1, right, then what we have to do, we have to compare these two bits with this two bit state. So, in this two bit state, 1, 0 bits are there, not compared with the last two bits, 0, 1. So, that is why we have to consider last bit of this 1, 0, 1 and compare with uh, Okay, one bit state. In this one bit state, bit is one. So these two are matched. So we have to connect the state S2 to the state S1 when input is one. Okay. Here still output is zero because you see here one zero one. That means sequence is not detected, sequence is broken. So that is why output is zero. Okay. So, up to this state, that means up to last but one state, procedure is common. Now, let us consider last state. We have to follow the points that I have given in Miller type machine for the last state. Here, for non overlap type, move the directed state transition lines from last state to the reset state upon giving different input bits. Okay. So, now we have to connect this last state to the initial state okay upon giving an input zero suppose when input is given zero now let us check the sequence see here one zero 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 sequence is not detected so that is why output is zero suppose if if we connect okay the last state to the initial state with an input one then we have to check the sequence, right? See here 1, 0, 0, 1. That means sequence, the given sequence is detected. So that is the output is 1. So this is the state diagram for the non overlapping Miele machine. Now let us see the state diagram for overlapping case in Miele machine. In this case also, the state diagram is same as that of non overlapping case up to this last but one state that is why i will simply copy this state diagram and paste it down so up to this last but one state procedure is same as the top of the procedure that we have followed for uh, non overlapping melee machine okay but for last state the procedure is different that is already given uh, here let us see now here for melee type machine if the problem is a one bit overlapping problem, we have to compare the last bit of the last state with the one bit state. If it is matched, then move the directed state transition line from the last state to that particular one bit state. If it is not so, then we have to connect it into okay reset state. Okay, so the given problem is one bit overlapping problem. We have to now consider this last state here. Already at this particular state, there are three bits detected that is 100, 0, 0, 100. 0, 0. If I give input 0 at this particular state S3, then what happens? When input 0 is given, then we have to compare the last bit of this particular state with single bit state. Where is the single bit state? This is the single bit state. Here it has one bit, the bit 1. Okay. But here the bit 1 is there, but here the last bit is 0. That means uh, these two are not matched. Then what we have to do? We have to connect uh, right this last state to the initial state. So that is why we have to connect this last state to the initial state. Okay, initial state when input is 0. At this particular regard also we have to check whether the sequence is detected or not. Now see sequence, initially this is 1 and this is 0 and this is 0 and here in this state transition and this is 0. That means the sequence is not detected. Our sequence is 1, 0, 0, 1. But here 1, 0, 0, 0 
is appeared. So that is why output is 0. And then if I give an input as 1 here, okay, if I give input as 1 at this particular state, what happens? We have to compare this last bit 1 with single bit state. So here in the single bit state, bit is 1. So both are compared. So that is why we have to connect okay, the last state to this okay, state S1. So that means here the 1 which is already detected as state S1 is okay, common bit or overlapping bit. So now let us check here the sequence 1, 0, 0. Here upon giving an input to 1, okay, we have seen that sequence is detected. See, 1, 0, 0, 1. Therefore, in this case, the bit 1, which is in single bit state, has become the overlapping bit because this bit has become the part to the next sequence, okay, to the next sequence. So, this is for one sequence. This is for one sequence. So, for next sequence, otherwise other sequence, this one became, okay, the overlapping bit. But here, the main important point I have to say, in examination, it may be asked like this, design a state detector which detects the sequence. The sequence may be given any kind of sequence. For example, 1001 sequence using more type non-overlapping or overlapping or using melee type non-overlapping and overlapping. Like this question may be asked. So when the question is asked like that, first state, state diagram, okay, state diagram and then state table, okay, and third step should be state reduction, okay, and fourth step to state assignment and uh, fifth step, uh, number of flip-flops required, number of flip-flops required and selecting the type of flip-flop okay and then sixth step is excitation table table of flip flop considered and seventh step is circuit excitation table eighth step is k maps and ninth step is design these nine steps are required to design the sequence detector. Sometimes, you know, after drawing state diagram, okay, people think that design is over. No, design is not over. In this lecture, just we have seen how to draw the state diagram. We did not do design. See, if you want to design the particular, okay, sequence detector, Okay, which generates the given sequence, we have to follow remaining all these eight steps from step number two to nine. Then only design is completed. Okay. This video can make nuts like, comment, share, share, and subscribe.